what up? It's your boy Sego, and it's 5:34, and um, today I got some good news and bad news. But y'all stay tuned. Uh, yeah, y'all stay tuned. I'm headed to work. Y'all know the daily routine, and um, it's currently 5:35, and uh, yeah, just stay tuned with it. Stay tuned for your boy. Your boy is back, but um, oh my god, I keep running to these vets, man. Just wait, I'm gonna get me one. I think this is my next project call. After this Z, I'm saving it for a vet, either a C5 or a C6. And you know it's gotta have the twins on it, the twins sticking out the hood. And um, yeah, but um, yeah, I'm on the way to Jimmy's. I mean, I stopped vlogging for a little bit, but I was like, nah, if I do that, I'm going to end up not vlogging at all. But, I'm back at it now, so I can't complain. And, um, yeah. But, um, yeah. Everything's going good and going as planned. And, uh, if y'all remember the setup I told y'all I wanted to do 2016 before the year ended, um, then you know but if you don't i'm gonna put it like you know like a uh card up here or whatnot somewhere in the corners but um click on that if you know if you didn't if you don't know what setup i'm talking about but if you do hey you are already on topic but um right now i'm gonna focus on this road and um i'll get back with y'all at jimmy's and give y'all the good news and bad news but um yeah stay tuned y'all stay tuned I just made the Jimmy's dip across. I don't want to go through. And it seems like he's doing turbo on this Integra. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. that? Did that last yeah. night? How many horses he said he was trying to uh, get out of? Oh, right now he don't have a computer or nothing programmable. And like I told him, anything after 300 to 350, he's gonna pop his motor. It's got 160,000 exactly. miles on it. Oh yeah. Yeah. And this is supposed to be a bolt-on kit. There wasn't nothing bolt-on about it other than that. <laughs> so, hmm. Yeah. But just heard from somebody and didn't even read up on it. Uh, he just picked a kit. No. Without doing no research. Here. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh, we got uh, some new goodies today. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Oh, they plastic dip that color. Regulator. Okay. Argon time. Okay, then. We in business. Yeah, we can weld now. Oh, yeah. We in business. We in business. But this has got to be finished today. Uh, yeah, I got to drill a hole in the oil pan, plumb the oil line for the return yeah. on the turbo, we and run a pressure the line to the turbo. I can go a little bit, not too much. Yeah. Let me make sure it's up in there. Hold on, I'll get back to y'all. <sighs> well, that was a fail. But um but it had the jack <laughs> the jack up under. So I don't know why we wasted our time doing that. But um Yeah. Boy Alec just got in. Check him out, check him out. Let's go check out the block. Oh. 
plan. What you say, Bill? This uh, bends out the pipe. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's bends out the pipe. Yeah, this expands the pipes. Why? Why? Yeah. Yeah, I keep getting harder and harder. That way you can slide the pipes together. Okay, Ben. It's time for the. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get some tubes. That's all I gotta say. I'm gonna get some tubes. Get the uh, diamond plate. It's time. What um? Yeah. What I'm gonna do? Oh, this is the results. I don't know why I did that. Let me put this on bright. Got the little ceiling. That's all I gotta hit right there. Like overall, it's done. I just gotta get the little ceiling. Be clean, you know. And uh, yeah. It's not too bad. Look who we got here. Is it done? <laughs> Almost. I gotta hit that little part right there and that. And that. And it'll be through. Yeah, overall, coming along, y'all. It's coming along. As soon as I can get my um pistons, rods, and rod bearings, and get my crankshaft turned over, I can put it back together. Then y'all can see what's gonna happen, then. Yeah, I can see what happened. Yeah. But, um, yeah. But, it's been a minute, man. It's been a minute, I know. Well, it's only been like two days I missed out on. But, I'm gonna show y'all the call what didn't happen now. And, uh, yeah. But, um, you know what? I'm gonna go on and hit that right quick. And, uh, that way I can have some more time to be up there with them. And, uh, um, yeah, let's see what happens then. Alright, so far, this is how the Z look. I ain't even show y'all yet. With all the piping out. This should be an intake pipe right there. And the breather box go up under it. And, uh, yeah. But, Oh, let me show y'all something else too. If I can get to it. I don't they gonna let the car die. Um check this out. I don't know if I can do this and hold my camera at the same time. But let me try this. Now let get the picture. Hold on. Mm -mm, it goes up here. Hold up. That. <laughs> and this. I may have a little surprise for y'all. I'm going out of the way with this build, so it's gonna be, you know, kind of slow. But um, yeah, we're gonna show y'all the process. Right now, it's you know, kind of slow because I ain't got any part, no more parts in yet. I'm waiting on them. Supposed to be here next week, so all right, I can't, you know, I'm not tripping about it. So yeah, but what I did get in is a flywheel. Let me go show y'all that. All right, that's an old flywheel. All right, this is the old one. All right, I ready for this? Bang! That's the chrome steel flywheel. And uh, yeah, this one is heavy. Heavy. And this one's like 12 pounds, light, real light. Throttle punch is gonna be great. But um, yeah, that's real heavy. I might, I don't know, I might keep it. I don't know, sell it. I don't know yet. Trash that garbage. You don't need it no more. <laughs>
might touch it, somebody that needs it. Well, you never know. Maybe. Yeah. But yeah, that's the new flywheel. And y'all seen the, uh, if y'all seen the new Yeah. Well, but yeah, everything feels smooth, you know. But right there. But, um, yeah. Yeah, that's how we do it at J&J. &J. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get back with y'all in a minute. I'm gonna, um, put this back. And I'm gonna show y'all the rest, you know, what's gonna go happen on the V. And, um, oh yeah, I'm probably finish this. Alec finishes, um, starter. We got the, um, solenoid in. So, all we have to do is put that piece back together and, yeah, and it can probably be through. I had put the starter back together, Alec, but where's the other piece? Um, it's working, but I changed, I put the old, um, piece out of it. I forgot the name of it, but here it is. The bushings on the old one, which is in there, it's, um, they're not any good, to be honest, but... I, mean, I had to make it work because this one it'll fit where it wouldn't line up at all that's the only thing it was because it was kind of big but oh well we have to make it work somehow but these screws i got them out because they were stripped yeah so i don't know if i'll have to come back and finish it tomorrow or something because i'm finna probably go in a minute Edit this blog and um yeah. But so far so good. I mean it's coming along. We're gonna get the one eight back on the road too. If y'all haven't noticed sitting down for a minute, feel like I'm not doing anything on it. But hey, it is what it is. Takes time. And um yeah. Yeah, I gotta Y'all got a surprise coming Saturday, so y'all just stay tuned on that. The next build, you're gonna like it. So, yeah. But, I'm into right here. Uh, if you're new, hit that subscribe button, you already know. Uh, yeah, and share the video. And um, hit that thumbs up for you, boy. And let me know in the comments, you know, how y'all like the videos or whatnot, but. I'm a um yeah to call it a day and uh yeah but I didn't even get to do my block today which I should have did but I'm I mean I still got time to do it it's just small little small seal on it I can knock that off in no time and uh yeah and then do the other two heads yeah but go out the what you want man. Trust me, everybody asks me, where you get all this money from? Where you get all that from? It takes time. Go after what you want. I swear you can make anything happen, man. I promise you. And uh, chase after that dream. Don't let nobody talk you down. But um, yeah, I'm out. So I forgot to tell you all the good news and bad news. Good news is release well let me start off like this the bad news is well jimmy and his crew have to um get out of that uh get out of basically get out of that garage and like within what three months or four months but he's staying until you know they get they tell him to leave and um you know i would do the same thing uh but good news is he had a backup plan already and he found another garage that's better. And well, I could say garage or basically shop that's better, you know. And um, yeah, and it's right, it's not too far from that shop. So it's still right there where everybody, you know, can go over there and, and check him out. So yeah, but that's all I wanted to say. That was the good news and bad news. But, um, yeah. Man, that really sucked because 
I really hate, you know, when that happened, when that, you know, when stuff happened like that. But, um, I mean, he he wasn't worried about it, and, you know, it seems like, like he said, every time something, you know, bad comes up, it always turns out good. And, um, that's good because he didn't even, he wasn't worried. He had a backup plan already. That's good. We all, everybody should have a backup plan, regardless in life. So, especially in those type of situations nowadays. So, yeah. I was just sitting up here in the vlog and I went by and I was like, dang, I forgot one thing. So focused on, you know, so much, trying to get so much done in the shop. So, yeah, that's all I want to say. That's it.